I remember walking and walking and walking and walking and thinking I was going to do a circle at some point. And then looking at a map and realizing this just goes on forever. Italy. I'm focused on something on my phone in Rio and Omizzle. They're having a good time. As we landed in the Naples airport, there was a big strike going on. So no Ubers and no taxis. Something us Americans aren't really used to. Not the best way to start the trip. So what did we do? We found a private company that would take us in a van to our hotel. They quoted us one expensive price that we agreed to. But when we got all our stuff in the van, they doubled it. No way, Jose. Alright, you try to call that first time? Yeah, Dad, please say yes to offers. <laughs> <laughs> like, so, no, no, no. No, I, I called the website. She's checking, she's gonna call the, the place to bring the van. What's wrong, my love? What happened? Okay. Someone okay. in my kinder egg is right in an emergency meeting right now, but it's... no one's coming. He I asked him, Rio, go ahead and speak your piece. What happened, Rio? Someone ate my Kinder egg. Okay, do you have any suspects? Do I have suspect of Dee Dee and Joe. Okay, no. I think that's a good lead. <laughs> I think that Omar is the imposter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go out. I'm going to go out with Joe. two Kinder egg trash things in there. Dee Dee ate one and Omar ate the other. What, Rio? Rio, yeah, I was with you the whole time. Just yes. get us off our friendship here. TJ Jackson <laughs> went the nearest one to my Kinder Egg bag, and he always loves sweets. It's exactly. like so hot, and look at what he's wearing. Is You're awesome? selling out your own dad. You're yeah. selling out your own yeah. dad. Yeah. <laughs> wow, Omizzle. What have you done to our child? All right, the walk has begun. We're in Naples. It's hot. We're making it happen. And as Omizzle said, this will be one of the highlights, one of the biggest memories of the show. I'm doing this tour. I'm not afraid of obstacles. I'm definitely not afraid of letting the universe sometimes decide the route we're supposed to be taking. So yeah, we're walking from the airport to our hotel. That was until a supporter of mine saw us and took us four by four to our hotel. So very nice of him to do. But like Omizo and I were talking about, memories were made. That's for sure. No one's gonna forget that walk. It's that time, we got the crew, and we are on our way to Capri. Francis has been waiting for years to go back to Capri. And in minutes, that's what we're doing. You excited? I'm excited, yeah. I'm excited for the food and the wine. The food and the wine? The food and the wine. So it's almost that time where we're gonna load up, get on the boat, the ferry, and get to Franny's favorite spot, uh, Capri. First thing we're gonna do, I'm sure, is get some food. Hey, are you girls excited to go to Capri? <laughs> Did you just yes. kiss me? Almost hitting her. <laughs> yes, yes, I'm excited. Have you been before? No. You've never been? I want french fries. You want french fries? You've ever, ever been? been? This is Do probably. They have food? Yes, they have food. we're gonna go. This is probably one of the prettiest places you'll ever see. Really? I'm excited to swim. Really? Me too. We are here in Capri, and like last time, it just amazes me. Definitely one of the most beautiful places in the planet. It's magical, it's wonderful, it's special. Franny has a pizza Italian spot that she loves here. She's on the search to find it. Where is she? Where is Franny? There she is. She's lucky, she's investigating. Where 
Where's your spot, Francis? I don't remember if it's this one or this one. Okay. Or find what you where, want, Francis? Where does a bag of bread go? Bag of bread is gone. Jeez, guys. Francis? Yes. Did you find what you like? I found what I like. What did you get? I'm going to get a Caprice sandwich. Yes. Caprice. No country can beat it. Good. Yeah, and according to Chica, this they got all their ideas from from Greece anyway, so. Of course. <laughs> Everything started in Turkey. <laughs> right? That's all she talks about. It's so funny. I love it. I was only seven when I visited Capri, but even I knew how beautiful it was. You are definitely right about that, Rio. How about the water? Was it fun swimming in the water? It was really fun swimming in the water, especially since there was salt there, I could float freely. And Joe, what do you remember about the water in Capri? It was very rocky, but we were able to swim very far out. I think that was one of the best water sources I've ever been to. And there's Didi picking up rocks. There were many cool ones. About to go onto a tram to get to the top in Capri and uh, walk around. Got my bug spray this time, so no biting me. Not happening. I don't know what that is either, Omizzle. I thought you were allergic to those things. To what? <laughs> Children. Walking and walking and walking and walking and thinking I was going to do a circle at some point and then looking at a map and realizing this just goes on forever so we're about to do a lot of walking. Truly, definitely one of the most beautiful sights in the island, in Italy, and even in the world. Um, obviously, uh, there's many beautiful sights, but this one's up there. It's really cool. 
It's beautiful. It's just a wonderful combination of water, um, geology, sky. It's just beautiful. These rocks may be one of the most beautiful sights I've ever seen. What are they called? The rock you like is called Arco Natural, but it's also called the Tunnel of Love. Tell me why you love Capri. What I love most about Capri is the scenery. It's so beautiful. I mean, even from their park benches. They just put so much detail into everything. They really do. It's a very relaxing place. It's just when we go, it seems to be hot, right? Now, it was very hot, but we had a beautiful time. Yes, we sure did. I can't believe that these streets are so narrow and this is how people have to deliver food and their goods that they need on a daily basis. Even ambulances. That was an ambulance that just went by and it's pretty amazing. I also like how they had spots to eat. Oh, this gelato was delicious. I think it might be the kid's favorite part. Rio was too excited. <laughs> excited is an understatement. He was on another level. Oh, Mezzo always has to have a Coke with his any food he gets, but I get it. The man has good taste. That's a cool shirt, Omizzle. Hey, that's one thing I gotta say. Omizzle was always rocking the TJ Jackson merch. <laughs> I love it. Now, Franny, I know this answer, but tell everyone how many times you've been to Capri. This is my second time in Capri, and I have to say I loved it just as much as the first time. My goal, or my bucket list one day, is to actually stay maybe a couple of days and just bask in the beauty of Capri. I can't wait to go back and actually experience it in a romantic form with TJ. Okay. These little shops were really cool. We got to purchase some pretty cool earrings, necklaces for people that we love back home. And it's just memories. Great memories. I'm not sure what was happening, but there was a big party going on when we were there. Honestly, I think it's like that every night. People are just happy to be there. Capri is such a chic city. I love it. Everyone's dressed up, have their linen shirts and pants on. They sure were. That's just how the Italians do it. Look at the beauty. Yeah, what's your thoughts on nighttime Capri? You know, I think I like the daytime more because then I can really see everything. But when you're at the very top and you see the sea and all the lights in the background, it does have a special beauty to it. Now for me, I definitely like the nighttime better. Yeah, the daytime's cool and all, but nighttime is just the vibe. The way it's lit up and it just seems like you're in a whole nother world. It's really cool. But since I'm going my YouTube channel... <laughs> just say it for the family rules. Go ahead. I didn't even know we were making a YouTube video, alright? Okay, say it real quick. I don't know. Capri was awesome, but it's time to go home. So, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, hit the bell to get notified every time we post a new video. And as you know, peace out. No. Three. One, two, three. We are signing off for Capri. We want to thank you for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, hit the bell. And what, Joe? Um, as you know, one. peace, peace out. out. And we are off to London. Here we come, London.